Thanks to all of you again. Let's talk the economy. On a technical scale, it seems to be improving. Five straight quarters of overall growth. The U.S. labor market ended 2023 on a high note, adding more jobs than expected. Unemployment rate uh, considered low for about two years. President Biden is crediting what he's calling Bidenomics. Uh, but most Americans aren't feeling it. A recent Gallup poll shows 32 percent of Americans approve of the president's handling of the economy, 67 percent disapprove. Ms. Williamson, statistics are one thing, but Americans also know how it feels in their pocketbooks. Why is there this disconnect? There's a disconnect because the official narrative is a lie. When they say the economy is doing well, it's doing well for 20 percent of Americans. But those 20 percent are like on an island surrounded by a vast sea of economic despair. When the majority of Americans live paycheck to paycheck, can't absorb a $500 unexpected expenditure, 39 percent of Americans report skipping meals in order to pay their rent, when we have the highest poverty rate of any advanced democracy, when we have people putting GoFundMe pages up on the Internet to pay for life-saving operations, one in four Americans living uh, with medical debt, over a million Americans rationing their insulin, a third of America's workers living on less than, working for less than $15 an hour, and half of them cannot find a place to live. Do you realize the level of rage that they feel when the president well, tells speaking, them that the economy is doing well? well they just don't understand.